Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video of Fox Flix on Connie X. Now, as all of you should know by now, I pre-record my videos, that way I have free time in the future. So, yes I'm still recording this, it's still October, it's before Halloween, but this will be going up like October, like November 4th or something. Uh, hold on, let me actually check that real quick. Calendar, uh, up, yep, November 4th, okay, let's do this. We're here with Connie X and giving the Adventor Digimon Custom Dog Digivolutions. Let's hop in and see these new dog monsters. Last year for the Spooktober Spectacular, I made a video discussing what if all of the adventure Digimon Dark Digivolved just like Ty Skull Greymon. But over the past year, because that. of your support, this channel has leveled up, and now we get to do a ton more custom <laughs> art videos. Let, 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 so instead of finding existing Digimon and finding ways to make dog, them work as Dark uh, Digivolutions, I have teamed up once again with the frightfully talented Weirdomon to Great give guy. custom Dark Digivolutions to the adventure partner Digimon. It's Karn's Spooktober Spectacular. <laughs> Three. All right, let's see what you got. What is up, digital creatures? My name is Carney X, and welcome back to Khan Spooktober Spectacular. Oh, if it's not welcome back, back you really should subscribe now before a ghost comes and harvests your soul. I heard they're doing Ooh. that this year. It's kind of messed up. <laughs> hey, so I'd subscribe if I were you. And yes, today we are giving custom oh, wait, no. dark evolutions to the adventure cast. Some of the picks from last year I really liked, especially Skull Balukimon for Garurumon. But it I think fits. as we have the opportunity to explore it with custom art, I just thought it'd be really fascinating to go another way with it. Instead of just finding seven Digimon that are the closest thing to Skull Greymon, what hmm. if all of them got something more personal and less bony? <laughs> and as it's Spooktober, okay. Weirdomon and I also agreed it'd be pretty More fun personal, to give each of these new bony. Dark Digivolutions <laughs> designs inspired by famous horror or horror adjacent characters. And now before you okay. say, oh Khan, that's so weird, Digimon would never do that. Dundevimon is based on Venom and Boltmon takes huge Wait, really? inspiration from Frankenstein's monster. That's and obvious. there are myriad other examples too of Digimon uh, being Dun based Devimon on existing properties Venom. and characters. So this is that. actually super on brand for that. them. And I think just brings an extra level of depth and scariness to these Dark Digivolutions. Alrighty, <laughs> first up is Bergeron's Dark Digivolution. Okay. Love is a great crest to twist, and I always want to see a more Love bird like alternate hatred. to Garudamon. Obviously, Garudamon is also bird like, but it has a lot of humanoid parts, which kind of get lost when it becomes Phoenixmon again. So, and Weirdomon so corrupted like Bergeron into chest. her dark ultimate, Clawdramon, Ooh. inspired by the 1957 B movie, The Giant Claw. I love this design, as I said, because it feels more unique to Bergeron. This frightening vault like form feeling like an appropriate corruption. Hmm. There's no Got specific episode tits. of the original adventure I think would be most appropriate for this, but I do think that Sora's love for her friends and family could be easily manipulated to cause a dark digivolution, especially if I she was desperate that. for Beamon to digivolve to fight Myotismon or something. So this is the oh, twisted yeah, feral side of that love. I also think Claudramon fills a purpose we're somewhat missing in another respect, a hmm. connection between Bergramon and the virus Mega Ornismon. Then Ooh. for Togemon's dark digivolution, Weirdomon was inspired by Little Shop of Horrors, Audrey 2, and so ah. Togemon Dark Digivolves <laughs> to become Flytrapmon. Of Ooh. course taking its name from the Venus Flytrap, because Venusmon is taken and Flymon is taken. This Digimon's mouth that feeds on insect Digimon ah, actually yes. opens up to reveal its true form underneath. The corrupted ultimate keeping the femininity of Lilymon, but twisting mm. it into much more of a honeypot, if you will. Mimi first yeah, activated her that. crest in episode 35 of Adventure, during a fight where Dark Tyrannomon threatened her parents. So Mimi's purity Ooh. or sincerity activating in a dark or fearful way in response to this threat is very believable to me. I could see Flytrapmon nice. being easily able to digivolve to Hydramon, and also would be best oh, yeah, of friends totally. with the newly revealed Orliamon from Ghost Game. Then Ooh, for Kabuterimon, a fun connection is that Izzy's Crest of Knowledge was activated during an escape from Vadamon, the alien Digimon. And Ooh. as we're going for a horror theme, wouldn't it be fun if some of Vadamon's data fueled the evolution that Izzy's dark determination triggered? Like Thus, what? Kabuterimon is transformed into its dark ultimate, Uchu Kabuterimon. Uchu means space in Japanese. Oh my guys, it's based on a xenomorph, isn't it? It's a and Xenomorph. of course, this devastatingly devious Kabuterimon evolution, Weirdomon took big inspiration from the Xenomorph of the Alien I franchise. I freaking caught it. Then for Joe and he oh, hold on. We're back, and I freaking caught it with the Xenomorph. <laughs> I haven't seen this yet. This is my first time viewing it. 
Kakumon, I again don't know if there's a perfect episode for Ikakumon to Dark Digivolve to. And maybe that's just because I haven't rewatched mm. Adventure in a while. But given Joe gets his crest in episode 16, aka the Skull Greymon episode, I think we can kind of mm. make this Dark Digivolution work in the next 20 episodes before Zudomon finally debuted in episode 36. Joe had oh, his yeah. crest for 20 cool. episodes before he got to use it, Jesus. I also thought <laughs> it'd be nice to keep more aquatic elements from Plesiomon here in addition to the Zudomon slash Vikemon influence, and so Weirdomon created Megalomon. Inspired Ooh. by Jaws and of course the Megalodon, this fearsome Dark Digivolution would be I indiscriminate like in who it attacked, with its powerful Jaws, Hey! Uh, this yes, also gives that. us another Shark Digimon, which we are sorely lacking in, so always Plus, nice- look! It's got a tribal band tattoo, it's actually got a lot of tribal tattoos. And look, the Crest of Reliability has a score through it, meaning it's no longer a reliable Digimon, but instead, well, it's a backstabber. To at least have more fan-made options, and combine some of that Zudamon slash Ikakumon fur with the Plesiomon aquatic animal themes as I talked about earlier. A detail nice. I really like here is how Weirdomon put a slashed scar through the Crest of Reliability, oh, just tattoo about indicating that. the destruction or corruption of that crest. Anjumon <laughs> is a fun one. TK and Patamon being so youthful, I think makes corrupting them fun any way you cut it, and pretty much any episode could warrant <laughs> it. Like so Anjumon Dark Digivolves to a new form in Slashamon. This Ooh. Jason and Freddy Krueger design is such a breath of fresh air. It's nice it. to see Devimon and Devimon adjacent corruptions for Angelic Digimon, but leaning into two horror icons to create something demonic rather than strictly <laughs> devilish is wickedly inspired from oh, Weirdomon. Thanks. I'm a really big fan of the overcoat acting as sort of mock wings, as well as those I Digimon that. stripes that you see on Digimon like Greymon, Brachiomon, etc., being yeah. folded into yeah. the Freddy-esque sweater. From top to bottom, a nice. terrifying embodiment of hopelessness, ready to hack and slash from hell. And then is Gatomon, and what can I you mean, do for the Wizardmon's death, right? It just has to be the trigger. It's what initially oh, caused yeah, Angelwon I mean, to appear, so it certainly is no stretch of the imagination to picture it triggering a dark God, Digivolution goodness. instead. With I that said, that. the Darkness hidden inside the light spills out from inside Gatomon and Dark Digivolves her to Trickstermon. The fear, Ooh. sorrow, and darkness coming forth from inside Gatomon to create a wicked shapeshifter Digimon Literally capable of assuming of any form it sees fit to cause distress and violence, inspired by the movie Species. I see oh, Trickstermon as being movie. the feminine counterpart to Betsumon, but going oh, further God. in her wickedness than Betsumon thing, ever could. The form also makes me think of the sort of in between stage we see during Gatomon. Gatomon's evolution sequence to Anjuwamon, which feels very fitting for this hmm. misshapen mistake of a Dark Digivolution. And then Garurumon and Matt. The negative energy from Matt not believing in his ability to maintain his friendships with the other Digi Destined during the Dark Master's arc hmm. manifests in transforming Garurumon into Lycanmon. Werewolf Ooh. mythos and movies like American Werewolf as well as Kujo informed Weirdomon's design process I here. Like a look at what would happen if where Garurumon became a fully feral werewolf. Werewolf, completely out of control nice. and foaming at the mouth, ready to pounce on its prey. Look at those this white freakish eyes. beast is marked by the same bat symbol Myotismon has, indicating its turn to the darkness, which would be particularly frightening in the Dark Master's arc. And that does bring us to Skull Greymon. And now Weirdomon has crafted these incredible dark digivolutions themed about He's horror and generally scary cultural icons. It would almost be rude not to give Greymon one too, right? <laughs> so while Skull right, Greymon remains the OG, G. One more Greymon variant can't hurt, especially <laughs> when the negative that. energy instead of hollowing out Greymon instead became the burning flame of courage twisted to malice and forced Greymon to dark digivolve to Shin Greymon. Taking Ooh, design inspiration Shin from Godzilla. Shin Godzilla, yes. this flaming molten Greymon love that is an movie. active biohazard that can scorch Earth just by walking on it. A terrifying abomination only possible because of the cowardice of humanity. Shin Greymon yes. is the penance of the digital world on humanity. Phew, Dark Digivolution sure does get dark, huh? And then- Now, I'm gonna say my favorites just real quick. Top three favorites. Shin uh, Greymon, and the, uh, the Kabuterimon one, and, and uh, I guess Megalomon, and uh, will be tied with Slashomon. And those four will be my top three picks. Let me know what your favorites are down in the comments, then go to the original video and tell the same veil. There they are, all of our Dark Digivolutions for the Adventure cast created by Weirdomon. 
If you love this art as much as I did, please I do, do go check out Weirdo Mon on Twitter and Instagram. He also has a Kofi now if you want to donate. And of course, oh, if you want to see more videos like this Y'all get here. commissioned, you can also donate to me <laughs> by becoming <laughs> a channel Dumbo. member like the wonderful people you're about to see, including my sovereign ZDK14 and my Digi Destin tape. And there we go. That is the end of it. The rest of this is just him giving things like normal. So, anyway, folks, that is going to be the end of today's episode. I want you to remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe more, and I'll see all you folks next time when we click on. Peace out.